Accurate forecast seven years in a row. Chief Meteorologist Luke Zampi. Well, this is a change. Temperatures down into the 60s now this afternoon after we had some brief rain showers push through around midday. Now most spots just cloudy and cool. 69 right now officially here in Green Bay on the Storm Team 5 Skyview Network. Powered by Pella Windows and Doors, uh, the view similar in the Oshkosh area, although trying to thin out the clouds a little bit there. 71 and cloudy in Appleton, and right now it's 66. Thunderstorms and storminess to our west and to our south, and that should really stay out that direction as we head through this evening. What we may have is just an isolated shower yet to contend with, but you can see the general track on everything is to stay down to our south. So for the time being, the threat for storminess is going to be off to our west as we head through this Tuesday evening. Close up view on the radar showing some pop up thunderstorms out in central Wisconsin. Not a whole lot happening around the rest of the area. We did have a few rain showers down in Sheboygan and Fond du Lac counties not too long ago, uh, but those two are shifting south. So it's going to be more miss than hit showers. We stay cooler for now, although there's a warm up in the forecast as we head into the weekend and beyond and then warmer and more humid again for the weekend and beyond. Right now, as we look in Manitowoc along Maritime Drive, temperature coming in here in Green Bay at 69. We have a northeast wind at 15. And that's a big reason why we're cooler. That northeast wind is cool and dry, and it's going to continue to be that way here in the near term. So mid and upper 60s to lower 70s at best, the exception being Fond du Lac at 78 degrees. A northeast wind between 10 and 15 miles per hour in most locations at this time. The dew points are comfortable in the mid 50s to around 60 and we're going to stay comfortable on the dew point as we head through tomorrow and Thursday. Humidity building in Friday and Saturday, so there's some more humidity there. Then a break Sunday, Monday, a couple nice days, and then we get back into it Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday of next week. So this cooler weather pattern is only going to last another day. Very low 70s tomorrow. Expected to um, make it back into the upper 70s to around 80 for Thursday and Friday. 80 on Saturday and then low to mid 80 starting Monday and beyond and kind of holding that then as we go through the back part of August. Here's the broader view on the radar and satellite combination. A couple swirls in the clouds as you see. Those are weather disturbances that we're going to have to contend with. Behind the cold front out west, obviously the air is cooler. We're one of those readings. Officially we hit 73 earlier in the day, but there's some 60s up there. Marquette at 66, 63 in Bismarck. So that coolish feel in the air We'll stick around for tomorrow as we have highs in the upper 60s to lower 70s. Thursday, though, with more sunshine, we'll start to see the thermometer rebound back into the mid and upper 70s. So rain showers preferring southern and western parts of the state for tonight. Maybe a spotty shower for this evening, but otherwise tomorrow looks like a mostly cloudy type of day with a pop up shower still possible with that cool northeast wind. And then for Thursday, mostly sunny skies returning. So tonight, mostly cloudy, a spotty shower, possible lows ending up around 60. And then for tomorrow, mostly cloudy, it'll be cool with a hit or miss shower still possible. 72 for Green Bay in the Valley and 68 along the lakeshore, 74 up in the Northwoods. For your seven-day planner, 77 on Thursday and mostly sunny skies. We'll bring back a chance for some showers and thunder showers as the warmth and humidity returns. Friday and Saturday of the two weekend days, Sunday is your pick day, sunshine and low 80s. And a nice beginning to next week, Monday and Tuesday, right now dry and low to mid 80s. The Kagan Allergy Report for today, the pollen was in the moderate category and the mold was high. And our Facebook page is what you need to click like on right now if you have not already. WFRV Local 5. Kind of a weird sky out there today. It was kind of dark, but then the sun was coming yeah, through. Yeah, it, it sort of felt like fall. That word, that it, word. It sort of did. Yeah. We're not going to go there quite All yet. All right, thank you, Luke. We'll check back with you shortly. And we're back with more right after this. Stay with us.